I think with a lot of other people, I just watched the Five Nights at Freddy's trailer 3 for the movie that's coming out on October 27th of this year. And let me say, I think this is the best trailer that we've gotten, like just out of all of them. I think out of the teaser, the first trailer, but I think this one just has so much in it that really like hypes it more up for me. I think that there's just something great about it. So I kind of want to talk about the good, the iffy, I guess, the bad, you can say, and the unsure about from the trailer. I'm going to be keeping this really short, so yeah, let's get into it. I think starting off with one for bad, I think the opening of the trailer where the cupcake jumps onto the, like, the junker guy trying to look for whatever, I don't know, actually, maybe scraps or money. When Carl jumps onto his face, I thought that looked really cheap. And, like, there's something about, like, it's not uncanny that it's, like, this really bright thing, bite of 87-ing this guy's head. But, I mean... It's still kind of cool to see that Carl will have, like, a bigger part in the movie than than in any of the games. I think another bad is how they're, they might be showing a little bit too much of the movie. Now, in a way, it's still all very mysterious of exactly what the movie and how it's going to begin, how it's going to end. But, like, I think we could probably all agree that the junkers, the people invading the uh, pizzeria, looking maybe for money or, like, they're breaking the all the attractions and stuff like that, the arcade games, are pro- that's probably going to be the first scene of the movie. We're going to start off with an intense scene of like some logos, some stuff like that, and then all of a sudden we're going to get, I think his name's Hank, he's going to break the lock and they're going to all enter Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, and it'll just be like a little thing of they're going to be swept up one by one. I don't actually have too many bads for this, so I'm going to go on to a little bit of the iffy, but I don't really have too much for the bad, actually. I really like this trailer. There's not too much uh, wrong with it, I have to say. It's very good. So let's go on to the little bit of the iffy. I think I'm a little iffy on whether the movie is actually going to be scary or not, or if it's going to be try and be a little bit more like Willy's Wonderland, where it's kind of more of an action movie than anything. It's definitely going to have those intense chase sequences and stuff like that, and it's gonna definitely going to have its uh, fair share of edginess, I guess you could say, some maturity from, you know, security breach, <laughs> but like... It still doesn't look like it's going to be necessarily a scary movie. Like, I've seen Megan twice, and I don't really think that Megan is too awfully scary. And just kind of, like, comparing them side by side, like, just with the trailer, I think that they might be more of the same thing, especially that it's the producer of Megan. So I have a feeling that maybe it won't be too scary, but it might be a little bit, like, interesting, intriguing, intense type of scares. Definitely going to be some jump scares, I'm sure of that. But I think, all in all, I think it probably will be more of a movie like Megan. And I think that if it's like that, I won't necessarily be disappointed. I think that just there is going to be a little bit of controversy about the movie when people are walking out of it. Now, I want to go on about the good. I think this trailer is actually really good, uh, ignoring those, like, two things that I mentioned earlier. I think the atmosphere of Freddy's looks awesome like completely exactly what i would expect coming from a five nights at freddy's movie i think the casting as well is also really well done i'm very 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 excited to see how these animatronics move because it just the way that they move in this one how foxy opens up the curtain and is running down the hallway i am so excited to see exactly what they have in store and what other things they have too. I know I'm just singling out Foxy, but I'm sure that Bonnie, Freddie, and Chica are also going to have their moments where they're going to be cornering Mike or Abby or something like that. And this thing is going to get intense. I am so excited for that. And let me talk about Springtrap or Spring Bonnie. We don't really know exactly which one he is right now, but I think it's probably a safe bet to say that that is Spring Bonnie. Wow. He looks awesome. The first trailer gave us a good look at him, but this one makes him shine even brighter. There's something so cool about seeing him just be, like, bigger than the other animatronics, too. He just seems much more menacing. What I also really like about the movie itself is just, like, not only do we have William Afton, but we're also going to have, like, other forces, like, objects that are going to be of danger. The Freddy mask going after the security guard as seen in, uh, the first teaser... That looks sick. Oh, it's going to be so intense. I cannot wait for this movie. It is truly going to be one of the best movies of the year. I'm very sure of it. 
I think if they play it right, this could be one of the best um, video game adaptations of all time. And to be completely honest with what they're showing us, this sure as hell can be a great movie. And I am so excited that I'm actually, like, going to be able to go see it in, like, two months. It's crazy. I'm truly speechless. I do not know what to say. But, like, well done. This looks awesome. And I can't wait. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.